to raise before. Yes, uh, just at the outset of this, just because we're now starting the, the study of this particular um, significant section of the Budget Implementation Act, and I was just wondering um, when we can expect to hear the Minister of Justice. I sort of thought oh. that perhaps she may be here this morning to kick off the study. Well, as you know, normally our procedure is, of course, to have the minister responsible of the, uh, of the bill uh, in front of us. Uh, we have certainly, through the clerk of the committee, extended the invitation to the Minister of Justice. Um, she had informed us that she was not available this morning, but we are trying to find any, an opportunity for her to appear next week when okay. we will resume, uh, I think it's Wednesday, our discussion and study, of course, of Bill C-74. Okay, but just the, the process I, is on. Sure, and just I, I bring up that point particularly because I just watched her on television this morning on on your morning on CTV, uh, talking about the new Divorce Act provisions at 8:10 this morning, right before I walked to the Senate. So, I she was in Ottawa at that point. So, I'm not sure why she's not available. But thank you, because typically the procedure is generally no minister, no bill. So. We'll look forward to seeing her soon. Senator Dupuis, the other vice chair of the committee. Thank you, Mr. Chairman, and thank you, Mr. Giroux. First of all, excuse my voice, please. I will uh, join my colleague, Senator Batters, to say it's unfortunate that the minister was not here this morning, particularly because uh, we heard from the steering committee that she's away all week, but she will be speaking to the other place this afternoon. So I find it uh, uh, unbelievable that when we have a bill as important as this one, that the minister not to be uh, make herself available and particularly to respond to the policies involved here. So I hope that she will be here next week. If not, uh, I think we should suspend our work until the minister appears before this committee.